Hello everyone. Thank you all, for warm welcoming. I was kinda scared to upload again. I was scared that you guys, will be mad at me. I was wrong. And I apologize. Once again thanks for every comment and I promise I won't disappoint you again. Now enjoy new video. 23 years old, still play Pokemon and single. It must suck, being a hardcore Pokemon player, and never hearing the words I choose you. You gotta learn how to shape your beard, or go to a barber, cause you look like a shrub. A shrub is a guy who can't get no love from me. That beard looks like you've been collecting your pubes since you were 14, just to glue it to your chin. With those glasses you could see people on a map waving. I'm 36, still play Pokemon and every other Nintendo franchise and have the same beard, but I'm married with two kids. Find another excuse. Maybe he doesn't want to marry two kids. 27 and just ghosted by a dude on Hinge who had a nose ring. Do your worst. So lonely she got a stock photo in that frame still. Your nose is above dude flexing his back. Oh my god you're right and I cannot unsee it. Rock bottom is fretting over random internet dude with a nose ring. Hope her plans didn't hinge on that. You're the type of girl who wakes up, gets herself ready for the day, and then posts a selfie with the caption messy hair. Don't care. Except you do care. So very much. That's my bud as gf. And I'll add she never watches her kid, talks shit about all of her friends to all of her other friends. Her social stuff is 100% selfies, with thinly veiled captions begging for likes. The only time she posts about her kid is when she can make it about herself. I'm not one to judge, so I'll just say I definitely don't understand her. How does it feel to know a guy with a nose ring is so far out of your league? That you don't even warrant a text back, even though you gave him roadhead on the way to McDonald's where you still had to pay for both of you. Went camping for two nights out of service and got called a ghoster on Reddit by my hinge date. Help me heal. Hairline. Help. I'm receding. Mustache. Don't worry bro. I got you. I'll be there in a couple of months. Nose ring guy. Ha 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 what are the odds? Just seen hers. What an incredible place, Reddit is. Back to Grinder, then. Your moustache is as straight as you. This is him. Just trying to think of the best way to roast him back other than letting him know all the dudes in my DMs are willing to pay to hang out with me. Even the homeless could afford what you're worth. Damn, this ain't even her thread, and she got roasted to a crisp here. I saw your date mate on another roast me, dodged a bullet with that one. Her stock photos on the walls, would have been planning wedding locations on your first date. Well at least you can go back to dating men. 25 year old welder chick who likes to think she's a badass, but really just fails at life. Slay me. You shaved your pits for this, didn't you? Just the one. You look like you smell like foot. Is that a scar? Dirt or did you shave your pits with a welding torch? Option 4. Her armpit has an Adam's apple. It is an infected lymph node. She should get it looked at by a doctor. You look like a Habsburg royal whose mother took the mite during her pregnancy. Thanks for doing yourself up for this. You look like you'd get married in dickies. 29 years old male, roast me please. Usually the comb over goes toward the bald. Bro he had to pick a side. Shoulder gone all straight forward. Man, I really needed a confidence booster today. Thanks. It's nice when we see people uglier than us. I loved you in the original Men in Black. Water, with sugar. You look like 5 cutouts of different people mashed together and none of them are pleasing to the eye. Steve Buscemi. Gerald Ford. Moses Lack. Clint Howard. Michael Strahan. Your dad had to roofie your mom, just so you could breastfeed. That is not the face of a man that was breastfed as a baby. 
I'm betting that most of his nutrition came from half empty beer cans full of cigarette butts. His teeth look like he was breastfed through a grease nipple. Cost $13.91 to take a nuba from one front tooth to the other. You look like you just came out of 4 hours in makeup, Tanera rolled as a war torn medieval peasant leper. He's the third Clegane brother, the molehill. You look like you teach a master class on public masturbation. Class. First things first. Yes my parents are related, and no that won't affect the performance of my teachings. Bro what happened? This alone cracked me up. Crack alone messed him up. You look like how Japanese propaganda portrayed white people. I can't post this picture because of my shitty internet. Search Lonchani Phantom of the Opera on Google Pics that's you and honestly I think that's a compliment rather than a roast. 21 years old female, home from college and my mom is keeping me quarantined in the basement for 14 days until I can interact with her please roast me. Does she know about the virus? No, but she's all too familiar with the parasite she's had for 21 years. Today I learned syphilis is only contagious for 14 days. They call her patient zero. I know this selfie too well, the trying to be casual, but I actually took this 100 times trying to find the perfect lighting. Probably added those freckles with a brown Crayola marker. It's better than her making you take a test for COVID-19. That's one test a blowjob can't get you out of. Your face looks like you have a flat ass. Flass or flat chest, but something is, in fact, flat. Personality most likely. Locked in a basement is probably your best case dating scenario. If I were you, I would unfriend myself. Or may or ghost myself for sure. How did you get that poodle to stay on your head? You got that teardrop to two from killing my boner. 50% of these replies are her posting them from other profiles. I'd never seen one of Tim Burton's rejected characters before. Because this girl's character has no depth. You look the type to catfish yourself. She would have a hard time believing someone was actually into her. Right? Even the skeleton behind her is turning its head in disgust. When your parents have money and you haven't done anything with your life. You look like the kind of girl that has no problem camming a live feed of your butthole to horny Japanese businessmen for bitcoin, but also claim you have too much social anxiety to ask for extra ketchup packets at a fast food restaurant because you think mental illness is a quirky aesthetic. Let's roast the COVID-19. People only notice you when you're a problem. Wish.com Ebola. So awful that even Las Vegas prostitutes stopped working just to avoid you. Nearly all sports leagues in the world cancelled because no one wanted to deal with his shitty ass in the crowd. I heard you have a fetish for old people, wit. The feeling is mutual. All the people at the old folks home say he's breathtaking. Nice K, D ratio, you. Also most of its kills are kill steals. Approximately 2% of people would rather die than be in your presence. Kim Kardashian fucked one person and it went viral. You went viral and fucked everyone. I'm a 60 year old Uber Eats delivery man in New York City. Yeah, 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 I know, I know. Have a damn hoss. Someone tell Dave Chappelle his dad broke out the nursing home. People count their fries after you drop them off. My first thought was, damn Hoopy Goldberg shaved her dreads. Stay safe out there. Why the fuck does your head look like the underside of my big toe? Ha 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 that would be because I've had my fair share of being stepped on in my life. Wait, that's actually kinda sad. Happens to the best of us. You pick yourself up, dust yourself off, learn from it, and keep moving forward that's all. I don't know dude, you look like the male equivalent of the friendly black lunch lady that calls me sugar. I'll give you this much credit, if someone finds a hair in their food, it isn't yours. 
You have the look of a man who smiles like a pothead at all hours while drug free, and will go out with a smile on his face trying to help someone. Do us a favor you fucking clown. Stay safe. Exes but have been BFFs for years. Both grew up LDS. Do your worst. Except for the background. This looks exactly like every picture taken at an adult video convention. I'm not old she isn't a cam girl he emptied his credit card balance on. He emptied more than just his credit card balance on her. He doesn't look that rich. Or rich at all. Well, he spent all $10 on her. I thought it said both grew up on LSD. I was like WTF. Then I looked at them and was like, seems legit. This looks like it would be in a coming of age movie where the hopeless nerd bangs a stripper. He still has a sock named after you. She must have been into him before puberty. She considers you the one that got away with it. She tossed him in the friend zone so quick, his hairline is still trying to catch up. If this dude hasn't installed three hidden cameras in her house by now I will eat my own dick. The only missionary position he'll ever be in around her is on a bike with an elder name badge. Obviously, she knows she's more conventionally attractive than him, so she posts on roast me, knowing she'll get underhanded compliments, while people are trying to insult him, strokes her ego to know that someone thinks she's hot. He doesn't seem to care, because he's come to terms with not being attractive. But when it's all you used to have going for you, and it begins to fade, apparently you are cool with letting others insult your BFF, if only for that sweet sweet compliment, he has a sock named after you. One ape horror artist, just turned 18 today. Do y'all have any original jokes other than eating dogs slash covered slash small eyes? Your wall looks like a memorial for a move tattoos. Junji Shito. You look like someone who would get promised an Archow, only to have it cancelled due to COVID, after they saw your first piece. Good luck with art school. It should prepare you for your future career of selling cake sitting videos online. Cake sitting. I shouldn't have googled that. Becoming horror artist is not hard, just shave your eyebrow. That will complement your lack of eyelashes. Your parents got to have only one kid and you decided to disappoint them like this. They actually have three, but I'm pretty sure they wish they'd only have two. They drowned the wrong two. They drowned the one two. Drowning two ones doesn't make a right. My parents thought I was a huge disappointment. Then I told them your life goals, and they wrote me back into their will. You look like a girl who would date me. Oh god is it that bad? Why are the paintings in the background self-portraits then? I'm the air guitar world champion. It must be easy when you're used to fingering things that don't exist. Air clitter. You look like a caveman who ransacked a pawn shop. You look like the forgotten brother of Zach Braff who he refuses to acknowledge. I bet you have air friends too. He must be getting mad air jobs from all those air friends. Nap has getting air zoned. Thanks for watching. I forget to ask you guys, what you think about new look of the video? Did you even notice? Let me know in the comments. Bye.